Hey guys, I just thought I'd do a short little video. Um, it's 8-8, 2021, Sunday night. Uh, it's about 8.30 Central Time. So, I was just thinking about things today, you know, I was thinking... Um, okay, so, Friday, I, r I ran out of heartburn medication from the doctor. You know, it was prescription. So, I, I, I called up Walgreens and... and uh, was trying to get my prescription filled and they had to send it to the doctor to get approval so now i called in i called today because i was having such heart bad heartburn uh it's all them it's induced you know it's all them um and uh they said that my doctor denied denied my heartburn medication which was helping i've been on it for like gosh three years since my heart attack my heart doctor put me on it you know, they denied it. So now I don't have any heartburn medication. And they were giving me super bad acid reflex and um, heartburn and all this stuff. I mean, they can make the acid in your stomach go up your throat, you know. And it's them. It's them doing it. You know, I don't I don't have all these medical problems. I'm healthy as, as hell, you know. I don't have, it's all, it's all induced stuff, you know. You run into the bathroom ten times a day, that, you know, that's them. Um... Uh, now, now that I ran out of heartburn medication, they give me heartburn. You know, it's all them. It's all induced uh, illnesses. You know, so you know, what do you do? Do you go to the doctor and be like, "Well, I, I'm running to the bathroom all the time, and I have uh, chronic heartburn." You know, acid reflex. You know, so it's unreal. It, it's really unreal what what they can induce. Um, they can induce all kinds of feelings. If you're not aware of your body, uh, you may not be able to tell it's them. I can tell. I've never had heartburn. Um, I've never had problems with the bathroom. I've never had any of those problems uh, in my life. You know, I mean, look at all the bad things that have happened to me in the past seven years. You know, I, I get diagnosed. I get diagnosed with a mental illness. And then, and then I have a heart attack. Now I have chronic uh, heartburn, chronic diarrhea. You know, I just oh, I'm getting all these illnesses. They're just I'm just getting them all for some reason. It doesn't make any sense. I've never had any of these problems before in my life. I am healthy. I don't have ulcers. I don't have I don't have heartburn. So then you know I went and got some Nexium over the counter stuff, which was really expensive. They, there's like maybe ten or fifteen pills in there. And you're supposed to take one to four, depending on how bad it, bad it is. You know, and it cost me 13 bucks. So it's like, that's super expensive. You know, and, and stuff. It's just, it's crazy. You know, I'm sweating like a pig. I'm sorry. It, it's, it's, it's humid out. Um, I'm cooking chicken and sweet potatoes for the dogs. So it's like having a heater on, you know, with the stove on. Because the kitchen's, the kitchen's right out there. So I'm sweating my butt off right now. But anyway, so that's what, uh, uh, that's what's going on. You know, and, and this relates to this too with the induced illnesses. Um, you know, there's, there's, there could be targets out there that don't realize, they don't realize um, that it's induced and it's them. You know, I mean, I mean, there could be, you know, because I've had suspicions. You know, I wonder if my brothers and sisters are getting hit. You know, I've had a few suspicions here and there. You know, are they getting hit? They're always tired and they can't sleep and all this stuff. Are they getting hit? It could be. Uh, they just might not be in a trauma-based mind control program and not even know it. You know, so... Um, my battery's dying, so I'm going to have to cut this short. But, um, so, you know... I thought about this, you know, my brothers and sisters getting hit because they can't get any sleep. My relative ha is always tired and she wakes up a couple times a night and all this stuff. I wake up a couple times a night, uh, you know, usually at 2 a.m. I wake up and get something to eat or whatever and get something to drink and then I go, I try to go back to bed and I sleep until they wake me up at 5, five in the morning. They, they let me sleep until 6.15 today though. So they let me sleep a little longer today. Now my relative's off tomorrow so I should be able to sleep in. Are they going to let me sleep in is the question, you know, we'll have to see.
But, so I'm wondering and I'm worried about my family members getting hit. Are they being hit and they don't even know it? They don't even know it. You know, they can, they can um, uh, cause stomach problems. You know, like I said, running to the bathroom all the time and cause an upset stomach and everything else. You know, I mean, they could do so many things with these weapons. It's, it's, it's unreal. And, and people could be targeted and not even know it. You know, it's just all of a sudden... You know, I know it, obviously. I know I, I know my body. I'm healthy. I have no health problems. Just like my heart attack, I have no plaque in my heart. No plaque. No, none. My, my arteries have no plaque in them. They're not clogged up. They're not anything. They're free as a bird, you know. And I got hit in two spots with these weapons. Or actually three spots. Because they hit me, they hit me Saturday night. And they were causing me to have a hard time bre breathing. And they, like, they said over V2K, they're like, don't do anything, don't do anything. And then they made it stop. 